General, we've got all equipment repaired, tactite weapons adjusted and given to the resonators. Non-resonators are also equipped and prepared for action, but the rain's getting heavier. Should we take shelter for the time being? One of our combat medics claims it's no ordinary downpour, and he strongly advises holding off any moves until it clears. Though young, his sharp intuition has been proven in previous battles. You've seen it first. However, I do agree this will be our last chance at organizing another attack. Sir, his name is... Gian. General, help. Please, help me. What do you make of this, Gian? Maybe you are right. The rain just happened out of nowhere. It's indeed unusual, but this is our only chance. The enemy we've been yearning to destroy is finally right before... And now, you're asking me to sit back and do nothing because of some phantoms. Silence. Is this your response? Or is it fear holding your tongue? No. I see. You're no different. We fear, we bleed, we suffer, and in the end, we'll all die on the battlefield. But what about your brethren, friends, and comrades, as you witness them viciously slain before your eyes? One, will you still remain silent when their souls demand an answer? There is no other choice. We must trample the pile of corpses at our feet and push on. Keep barking orders. Keep fighting until every last one of the, the retroact rain really creates illusions of past events. My soldiers will not succumb to those hallucinations. I will not allow it. We'll crush anything in our path. No questions asked. And I will pave the way for us all if tens, hundreds, thousands more of my men will die. So be it. We will win this battle by any means necessary. John, I have a question for you. What would you have done on that day if you were in my position? Whatever you say, I'll never answer those brave souls with such silence and cowardice. Talk to me, Gian. <laughs> Caught your guards in the night. Just like what happened on that rainy night. Retreat to advance. Tell the truth to the side. Yes. Go on. Keep fighting. General Gershul Lin, 
We fight to protect what we cherish. We cherish our comrades not out of cowardice or fear, but out of trust. The trust in their lives' worth. I cannot assure you I am always making the right choice, General. But we should never build our victory on top of endless sacrifice. <laughs> Is that so? As I see it, we are cut from the same cloth. Perhaps we are indeed, General. I share at least one thing with you. I too will draw my blade to fight for what I believe in. And I'll stop at nothing to see it through. General. General, you look pale. I am fine. Please go on. We just detected an intense frequency reaction from that tacit field ahead. That moon, it's gradually turning the sky. It looks just like how it was during the battle beneath- It's time. Sir, the Midnight Rangers are ready. Attention all troops. Take position and get ready to engage. Sir. When the moon turns full, the roving traveler shall return. The prophecy is being fulfilled. Here they are. They're not coming at us. Are they trying to protect something, or are they waiting for... With a TD outbreak of this magnitude and organization, someone must be orchestrating it. Almost full now, and the retroact rain falling. Rover, maybe this is the right time, Madam. Na Citizens of Jinjo, please remain calm and evacuate in an orderly manner as we practiced during previous. It's a pre recorded broadcast message. Our magistrate saw this coming, and she had General Jian devise an emergency plan a long time. This wave of TD attack should be over now. We knew this was coming, and we were ready, but oh boy, the amount of TDs is insane. Thanks for coming in time, Rover. It would have taken us much longer to handle. Oh, Director Tao Chi is here too. For a better rundown of the situation, you can find her near the city gate. Any update on the protected barrier? We've put in all our resources to repair it. But if those tacit discords keep coming at us, it might not hold up for long. Ah, I presume you must be Rover. Hmm, maybe we've met somewhere before. Anyway, please allow me to introduce myself. I am Tao Chi, a director at the Ministry of Development. I'm in charge of our defense. Thank you for lending us a hand. What's more, the current TD outbreak we're dealing with is directly caused by the retro... Once the protective barrier breaks down, tacit discords could manifest from inside Jinjo City. Rover, 
Remember what I told you earlier? The retroact rain is essentially condensed droplets of remnant energy that fall from the etheric. This remnant energy makes it a magnet for tacit discord. It records events from all times and places, allowing those who come in contact with it to witness illusions of and That's what we call the phantoms of retroact rain. It kind of works like how resonators resonate with the world. The mo- oh. And here's another interesting fact about the retroact rain. When it's raining across a large area, illusions pulled from the memories of multiple people can manifest at once. Nice catch. Jinjo has been a battleground for centuries. That's why it has to deal with the Thrinodium that represents a concept of war. Once the Retroact Rain reaches its final stage, there'll be thousands of phantoms. Phantoms of dead soldiers and tacit. This is the one major threat that has been looming over Jinjo. Our magistrate ordered the construction of this barrier precisely because of that. Indeed, the phantoms should only mechanically repeat what they had been doing. They shouldn't have the ability to interfere with reality. But the retroact rain can be significantly enhanced through the Thrinodian's power. As a result, Set phantoms become increasingly realistic, to the point of inflicting real harm on you. In that battle three years ago, our soldiers got into a gruesome fight against countless tacit discords, either native to Northal Barrens or produced by retroact rain and endless swarms of phantoms. Phantoms of tacit discords and our fallen soldiers repeated their indiscriminate attacks on everything. Soldiers could not tell friends from foe. The relentless rain even recreated the brutal deaths of their comrades, etched in vivid detail. The Norfolk Barrens turned into a living hell, and to this day, we can still hear the desperate cries. The battle beneath the Crescent was humanity's first recorded encounter with retroact rain enhanced by Thrinodian power. Your previous general sent back valuable video recordings of the rain. Those videos provided crucial information. Our people at the Black Shores have theorized that the Thrinodian abnormal moon sightings and the retroact rain may be linked. Yeah, something like that. But it's only a theory. We don't have enough data to verify anything. So, unfortunately, we can't predict retroact rains yet, but we know it's closely connected with Thrinodian's revival. The TD outbreaks are another- The moon just changed in an instant. If this theory turns out to be true, that means- And Jinjo's dealing with what happened three years ago. The Thrinodian's revival is never an independent occurrence. They could sense one another through some form of telepathic link. The revival of a Thrinodian in Jinzhou will trigger catastrophic events and affect other nations. We gotta hustle back to the teeth this pace, recalibrate our lament detector, and warn them before it's too late. Anyway. Please stay safe. That's all we've gathered so far, Rover. The TD outbreaks won't stop before the end of this rain. We must stay alert. Mom, there's another wave of them ahead. <sighs> Speak of the devil. I'll need to take a very long nap after this. Activate the defense mechanisms!
enemies here have been dealt with. Let's go reinforce the outpost. It's still under attack. Yeah. That's curtains for you. Lions rumble, evil crumble. Thank you. Some of us are still fighting in there. We must go help them. So much. It's dangerous here. Let's head back first. Uh, please tell me this is the last one. Rover, your moves are sharp as always. Dealing with so many TDs seem like a walk in the park for you. Rover, did you see that? Now, it's almost identical to what we saw three years ago, during the battle beneath the Crescent. I'm afraid... we're already running out of time. Report the situation, please. Madam Magistrate, the barrier has been fully repaired, and we have evacuated all residents. We've successfully minimized the damage. Well done, Director Tauchi. Indeed. It's been a while, Rover. It's been going according to plan, if I may say so. I was made aware of this in advance, and planned out our defense beforehand. Now that we are facing such an emergency, I cannot sit back and wait for Jui to save us. I will act and see my duty through. This is my decision. I have secured some much-needed aid for our city during my visit to the capital. Also, our experts should be ready by now. Rover, do you still remember Jui's? Now we have raindrops that fall upstream. And the Midnight Rangers General and the Norfall Barons. Ready to take on the old. This must be the right time Jui was talking about. Rover, it's going to be dangerous. You might directly confront a Trinodian. Your eyes look as determined as ever. You will be remembered as a heroic ally in our defense against external threats. Regard, may victory prevail the lasting night. I will pray for your safe return. Rover, I have informed border checkpoints across Jinjiao about your trip to the front line. You have been granted unlimited access, Yang Yang. You're one of our outriders. I hope you can go with Rover and provide assistance. You'll need to pass through a tacit field to reach our base in the Desert Rock Highland. Rover, Yang Yang, I'll be keeping the city safe as a patroller. Do come back in one piece, okay? Thanks! I'll give it my all. It seems the rain is not stopping anytime soon. In the city. Rest assured, you can count on me. I will keep everyone safe. M me too. Don't forget us, Lion Dance Troop. We got this! <laughs> As you can see, everyone's ready to... Rover, Yang Yang, safe travel. I've informed General Jian that you're heading to his place. He will be meeting up with you soon. May victory prevail the lasting night!
Defend the south gate. Enemy attack weakening. This wave is almost over. are spent. Hold your ground! Break! over! All tacit discords nearby have been dealt with. Now the city's defense Please update me on the situation in Jinjo City. Under Madam Magistrate's command, the barrier has been activated, and citizens are being evacuated to the safe zone. Washu Academy and Ministry of Development are on standby for further instructions. Baiju is overseeing operations at the Academy, and that rover, he is heading over to meet you. Yang Yang. I see. We have successfully contained the outbreak here at the base. I will go pick them up as soon as possible. The rain's getting heavier. There are signs of tacit discords reviving. Intense frequency fluctuations detected. They'll be passing through that area. I must create a safe... I need to clear the way for them as quickly as possible. Station. A couple more tacit discords here. I have to get rid of them. Thundering Mephis. Leave it to me. The Thrinodian's revival has done significant damage to the environment nearby. Things have gotten even more dangerous out here. The closer we get to Norfolk Barrens, the worse it gets. The streams feel heavy with dread and the smell of blood. There must be a brutal fight going down in the Deserok Island. The tacit field directed Tao Chi mentioned should be right up ahead. We must pass through it to reach our base and find General GN. I wonder what other anomalies await us ahead. Is that one of our soldiers? Those soldiers, there are more tabs of discords. Be careful. The rhetoric brain's effects are worsening. We must proceed with caution. There, another wounded soldier. The streams are stabilizing. 
I don't feel anything unusual about him. Are you... Are you Yang Yang? Oh, thank goodness. What happened here? The thundering Mephis. It came back. I'm... I'm part of the Deso Rock Highland supply transport team. This is where our supply station is. We work to keep our soldiers alive. We were on our way. Had to go through this thundering Mephis. The rain brought it back to life. In the end, I barely escaped. I can't. This place, it's dangerous. Watch out! It's him, General... Thundering Mephis. We must bring it down to keep pushing forward. Thundering Mephis is a blend of countless fallen soldiers' reverberations. As long as more soldiers are still dying here, it will always return. Not countless souls of our brave soldiers remain trapped in this rain to this day. General. Sorry. I should have arrived sooner. Yes. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Tian, the current General of the Midnight Rangers. Madam Magistrate and Tao Chi have informed me of your willingness to assist us. Thank you for lending us a hand. I should properly welcome you with Huang Lone's formalities, but as the current situation forbids that, I'll brief you on our plans as fast as possible. I've heard about your deeds from Madam Magistrate. You are a trustworthy ally, according to her. Here, Retroact Rain Antidote, developed by the Academy. While the antidote cannot shield you from its effects entirely, it should at least lessen the hallucinations. For someone to show up as a phantom in the Retroact Rain, two conditions must be met. Prior exposure to the rain, and a deep connection to the affected area. You were found in the Gorges of Spirits only recently. This is your first time setting foot in Jinjo, ruling out that possible. Moreover, you possess a similar ability with the legendary hero who once absorbed Thernodian. Jue prophesied about- I was told you'd come to the Norfall Barrens one day, to reclaim your lost power from over- I'll do everything in my power to help you make that happen. Yes. Madam Magistrate might not be aware of this as it happened before she was appointed. On the day I was selected to be the next general, Jue told me that beneath the full moon, guide the returning one to confront Thranodian. From the threat itself, he shall reclaim the power to come. And if you are indeed the returning one mentioned here, we may actually get rid of that monster once and for all. You might have noticed something off about that moon. 
We call it the Void Plenilune, once it fully takes shape. Over Thrax, the Thranodian of War would be reawakening soon. It is an ancient Terra that reigns over our land, capable of devouring weapon frequencies to enhance itself. The Norfall Barons have become a massive graveyard of weapons after countless battles. Those weapons would have made it even stronger than before. But we must act now. The Void Plenilune is already visible. We must contain the Thranodian swiftly. Any delay could allow it to recover and become harder to deal with. Hold on. We cannot afford to rush the plan. We'll get into the specifics once we reach our base. I've taken care of all the tacit discords nearby on my way here. The path ahead should be relatively safe now. Keep going and we'll reach the base soon. Stay sharp. Let me be your blade. Against the wind. Synchronization. Wait. Thrax's towering statue, built from repurposed weapons and debris, has long loomed over Jinjo as a foreboding symbol of our ongoing struggle. 